Are you able to get rid of your autoimmune disease as a professional athlete? What are the steps you need to take to get rid of it? What is the nonsense that they're telling you out there? And if you are able to do it, that's what we're going to discuss in that video. So if you got diagnosed with an autoimmune disease as a professional athlete, you maybe are afraid of your career and the doctors are telling you things like, your body is attacking you, your own immune system goes against you, maybe you got the diagnosis of Hashimoto, rheumatoid arthritis, colitis, Crohn's, all kinds of other autoimmune diseases, eczema, lupus, psoriasis, these kind of things, they are considered autoimmune diseases. Then you go to your doctor, which is obviously the first thing that most people do, and your doctor is telling you, yeah, we think it's an autoimmune disease or it looks like you got an autoimmune disease. Let's take the example, let's say you have Hashimoto or let's say you have rheumatoid arthritis and that is caused by your own immune system. So your own immune system is attacking you, is attacking your own body. Yeah, what a nonsense, what a bullshit. Just think about that for one second. Please, just take this one second and think about your own body. Would your own body, do you think your own immune system would attack you? Do you really believe that? Because that is what every med student still learns to this day in med school, in universities, even it was never proven. It was never proven that the autoimmune theory is true and they still teach it and they still say to everybody that get autoimmune that your body is attacking itself just because you see antibodies that's their proof and also every med student learns that antibodies show an infection in the body so is it now showing an infection because you have a viral infection or a bacterial infection or whatever or is it showing that your body is attacking you? So what's true of that? Either or. Can be both, right? How can be both true if antibodies... Antibodies can only show one thing. Is it showing that your body is attacking you or is it showing that there is an underlying viral issue going on and that's why your body is producing these antibodies because antibodies are there usually to defend you against foreign pathogens that are coming into your body or that are already existing in your body. So... What I say about that is that the autoimmune theory that they invented in the 1970s around that, because they didn't know what's, what's going on with you, is complete and utter nonsense. And you can totally forget that. And everybody that is saying to you is, in my opinion, just, I don't want to use that word, I don't want, want to insult anybody, but it just, it just makes me sad because people are actually believe that. People are out there and think their body is attacking itself and they can't do anything about that. Then if you can't do anything about that, why are there people out there healing it? How is that possible? How can you turn off that switch in your immune system that it's out of nowhere not attacking you anymore? Because this is not true. It's not f***ing true. It's not true. Your body loves you unconditionally and your body would never attack itself. There are other underlying issues which are viruses, pathogens, bacteria, toxic heavy metals, pesticides, herbicides, radiation. This is actually what's causing autoimmune diseases. When it comes to autoimmune diseases specifically, it's viruses. Viruses is a big culprit. The Epstein-Barr virus, the Shingles virus, the herpes virus, HSV1, HSV2, HHV6. These viruses in the herpes family, they actually cause autoimmune conditions so right now you know and you learned autoimmune is not what it seems and now you know the cause of autoimmune diseases so if you are a professional athlete now and you think am i able to do it i can say to you everybody is able to do it now when you know what's actually going on in your body then you can actually do something about that because before it was hopeless because how can you change your own body 
Now that you know it's not caused by that, it's actually there are true reasons behind that, you can actually do something about that. How do you do that? Changing your diet, including antiviral supplements, including immune system supporting supplements, cleansing your body out of these toxins, out of these heavy metals. This can be a way on how to get rid of autoimmune diseases. And you know what's actually funny? When you talk about or when you see videos of alternative health practitioners, they preach the same bullshit as the doctors nowadays. They also believe that the body is attacking itself. So this complete nonsense about autoimmune diseases just, I don't know, leached into the field of alternative health practitioners. And they preach the same bullshit about that, which is just making me sad because usually you should help people to heal and you shouldn't discourage them and you shouldn't make them hopeless because there is hope. Why is there hope? Because thousands, hundreds of thousands of people healed their autoimmune disease. Why shouldn't you be able to do it? You are able to do it. You are able to do it. You just have to be, you, you just have to be in the right mindset to Realize that you need to change your lifestyle, that you need to change your diet, that you actually sometimes need to take some supplements and some herbs and take care of your body, take care of your sleep. And then it can be possible to get rid of your autoimmune diseases. So do you. So can you do it as a professional athlete. And I hope this was helpful for you. I hope you don't feel that lost anymore. You don't feel that hopeless anymore because you shouldn't. You shouldn't because people are getting rid of their autoimmune diseases naturally, not just by treating their symptoms with some medications, with immunosuppressants, which is another thing. Immunosuppressants. Oh my God, I could make an, a whole video about that because it's so frustrating what's going on out there. Immunosuppressants, you know what I told you about autoimmune diseases, that your, immune, your own immune system is attacking you. That's what I'm telling you. That's why they lower your immune system with the medication, with the immunosuppressants. Meanwhile, the first thing that they're saying to you is not true. Your body is not attacking itself. It's a virus that is causing that. So the immune system is the very thing that you need the most when it comes to getting rid of autoimmune diseases. Meanwhile, you lower your immune system with like insane drugs that are like, that are really heavy on your system with side effects. And then you wonder why you get the flu every two weeks because they lowered your immune system so much. This is not the way to heal it. By far, it's not the way to, to heal it. And if you want to really know, if you want to know how to implement these things, how to change a diet, what kind of foods you should eat, kind of supplements you should take to get rid of that, to get rid of the viruses, the bacteria, the heavy metals in your system. There's a link in the description where you can book a free discovery call with us and then we can figure out if and how I can help you and go more into detail about that. Thank you for watching this video. See you soon and make sure to follow that channel.